Today, I saw the movie Ford vs. Ferrari, directed by James Madgold. Ford vs. Ferrari was definitely one of my most anticipated movies to come out this year in 2019. Ford vs. Ferrari was one of my most anticipated movies this year. Well, simply because it is themed around motorsports. My rating for Ford vs. Ferrari is a 5 out of 5. And here's why. Ford vs. Ferrari is based on a true story about Carroll Shelby making a car and racing team to vie for the 24 hours of Le Mans. But it all started with the Ford Motor Company going to Carroll Shelby telling them that they want to race the 24 hours of Le Mans and Carroll Shelby would lead the charge in making their car and making up the racing team around Ford. The story of the movie is great as it not only focuses on the Carol Shelby story, but it also shows the events leading up to what made Ford a rival to Ferrari. The story also gets into the insights of the people around the Ford Motor Company as well as Ferrari. But the whole center of the story is on Carol Shelby and his friend, the driver Ken Miles. More importantly, Ken Miles is the pivotal story point for Ford vs Ferrari. Simply what can I say, the acting is superb, especially with Matt Damon and Christian Bale acting amongst and between each other. That dynamic was great. James Bangle did well to direct these racing sequences, these scenes felt visceral and real. Although, on the aside, when you watch some of these races, there's one track they go to where I recognize it isn't the track they are at. With something like that, it doesn't factor in in this movie when it comes to my rating and review. I'm just wanting to mention that for the motorsports fans out there. They know what I'm talking about once they see it. Ford vs Ferrari is a spectacular movie. Definitely check it out. A movie like this could buy for spots when it comes to movie awards season. With my review done, I just want to mention that the Ford Motor Company still races the Ford GT in the form of a Ford GT, which is the second generation. They've been racing that car since 2016 in the various motorsporting sports car series around the world, especially with the IMSA and the WEC. With Ford making its return to sports car racing in 2016 with the Ford GT, 2016 marked the 50th anniversary of their Le Mans win in 1966. Although nowadays they do not perform in any of the prototype classes, to where they could win overall in the 24 hours of Le Mans, but they have won in the GT classes they perform in in their respective series. Sadly, at the end of the 2019 season, Ford announced that they are going to pull away from motorsports when it comes to a full factory team. But don't worry, the Ford GT will still be racing. Ford is selling customer Ford GT race cars for other racing teams out there. It was great seeing the Ford GT run under the full factory team for one last time when I was at the Long Beach Grand Prix this year. And may I suggest that definitely go out and check some sports car racing or any other form of motorsports out there, it is really exciting to watch. All right, this is the end of my review for the movie Ford vs Ferrari. Make sure to subscribe to the Spellgo YouTube channel for more of my contents. Thank you for watching, guys.